I'm Pastor George Borkhart, and this is another Higher Things Video Short. Jesus is on your team, not the other way around. That's the subject of today's Higher Things Video Short. Like, subscribe, ring the bell, get the app, share, donate. If you love what we're doing on Higher Things, like our videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel, ring, our bell, ring the bell for notifications, get our app. It's available on all major platforms. Share our content, sharing is caring, and donate. A tax-deductible gift to higherthings.org keeps us passing on that faith to the next generation. And young people, well, all of us, need that good news, need this good news in these dark times. Jesus is on your team. That's what's most important. But let's look at the text. The, tr the alternate text for the first Sunday after Epiphany is always the baptism of our Lord, which is the Eastern Epiphany text. So we want to make sure we catch it. That's why I always think it's good to catch it. But let's read. Then Jesus came from Galilee to the Jordan to John to be baptized by him. And John sort of tried to prevent him saying, I need to be baptized by you. And you come to me. And Jesus answered and said to him, let it be so now for thus it is fitting to fulfill all righteousness. And then he consented. That's John consented. And when Jesus was baptized, immediately, when he came out from the water, behold, uh, the heavens opened, and the Spirit of God descended um, like a dove upon him and came to him. And behold, a voice out of heaven said, this is my beloved son in whom I am well pleased. Everybody knows how religion runs. You get your stuff together. You get your changes and all of that together. And then you go to God and you hope that God picks you for his team that you're, it's like sort of sandlot softball or, or kickball when you're in elementary school, you hope that you're one of the picks that, that, that God does. That's how religion runs. And that's what was kind of going on in the baptism of our Lord as sinners, reprobates, bad people, whores, prostitutes, um, people who had, uh, had abortions, um, thieves, robbers, bad parents, disobedient children, all of them, coveters, gossips, all of them were going into the Jordan River, confessing their sins. They were baptized by John. John's baptism was a baptism for sinners. Now, the holy people, they were sort of gathered on the shore. They didn't go into the water, the scribes and the Pharisees. They were there because there was a show going on. There was the, the, the sort of influencers were there but they didn't need to go in the water because they didn't have sins. You see, everybody knows God is for people who have their stuff together. And those people on the shore had their stuff together. So Jesus comes from Galilee to the Jordan River to John. And you would think that everybody knows where God would go. That God would put himself on the team of holy people. That he would pick them pick me, pick me. No, that he would pick them. But that's not what happened. Jesus comes to the Jordan River and he gets into the Jordan River to be baptized by John. I want you to think about this for a second. I want you to think about this for a second. Remember I told you that religion is God has a team and there are sinners. That's a team. And you want to be picked by God for his team. You want to put on the, the, the son of God jersey and be a child of God. But the Son of God comes to the Jordan River and he goes into the Jordan River and he counts himself with you. He puts on the jersey of sinners. I got an example here. Why not? This is my 
genuine New York Mets jersey. I am a New York Mets fan. When I'm not pulling for LSU in the offseason, during baseball season, I'm a Mets fan. I wear the jersey of my team. Only Mets fans wear this jersey. Imagine this jersey said Sinners, which for those of you who don't like the Mets, it's easy, but you know what I mean. Imagine this jersey said Sinners, and there was another jersey that said Holy People. Jesus comes, and he doesn't expect you to get on his team. He comes, and he puts on your jersey. He puts on your jersey and says, I'm with them. I'm playing with them. I'm on their team. He became like you. All, and he was faithful, even being baptized, a baptism for sinners, so that you would be forever on his team. Nah, or that he would be on your team. That's better. So you don't come to God. He comes to you and he puts on your jersey. And here's the sweetest swap. He dies for you. He raises from the dead for you. And then he hands you his jersey, a son of God jersey, a child of God jersey, and says, you're on my team. But it all began with Jesus being on your team counting himself a sinner and being on your side. Religion has never been the same. It'll take a week to unpack this and we'll unpack this in the next few days. But that's enough. Jesus is on your team. I'm Pastor George Barkart and this has been another Higher Things video short.